start with flipping the cap off of the vial of the bacteriostatic water as well as the lyophilized powder of HCG. Wipe each top of the vials with a new alcohol wipe. Now take the large 10 milliliter syringe with needle out of its wrapping. Make sure the needle is on tight by pressing and twisting the cap of the syringe. Pull back the plunger to the black line in which your healthcare provider has prescribed. Hold the barrel of the syringe as you insert the needle through the rubber stopper of the water vial. Once the needle is inside, flip the vial upside down and push the plunger all the way to transfer the air from the syringe into the vial of bacteriostatic water. Then you will pull back the plunger to transfer the prescribed amount of bacteriostatic water into the syringe. Now insert the syringe filled with the bacteriostatic water into the rubber stopper of the lyophilized powdered vial. Hold at a slight angle and slowly press down on the syringe to inject the bacteriostatic water into the vial. Once all of the water has been pushed into the lyophilized vial, carefully remove the needle from the vial. Place the cap back onto the syringe and discard the needle. Lastly, gently swirl the vial of bacteriostatic water and lyophilized powder until all the powder has been dissolved into the solution. Start by wiping the top of the vial with a new alcohol wipe. Then, wipe the injection site on your body with a new alcohol wipe. Next, take your 30 or 31 gauge syringe with needle and carefully take off the caps on both ends. Pull back the plunger to the black line that your healthcare provider has prescribed. Hold the barrel of the syringe as you insert the needle through the rubber stopper of the peptide vial. Once the needle is inside, flip the vial upside down and push the plunger all the way to transfer the air from the syringe into the peptide vial. Then you will pull back the plunger to transfer the prescribed amount of peptide solution into the syringe. Pinch the area of injection on your body about 2 inches high and wide. Hold the needle at a 90 degree angle, pierce the skin, and carefully inject the medication. Lastly, carefully take the needle out, place the injection needle caps back on, and discard in a sharps container or a hard plastic container with a screw on top.